Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and I just made a video about tracing in black and white and then robbing colors. I thought I'd just go ahead and make it a little bit better. I found this clip art is 1263 by 1572, which is huge, so it's good and crisp. So here's my black and white, but if I just search Donald Duck, and I think, um, and it doesn't really matter which one of these pick. You pick if you're just going for color. I think it's this exact one right here. But if you look, this one's small. So you would try to find one possibly bigger. But if you can't, you know, you almost have to, what you could do, since we just need the colors, you could pick on another one. That one's a little larger. That's huge, but it's funny colors. Uh, there's a small one. There's one that's a little bit bigger. And it's got all the colors we need. So you could click on that, copy image, go back into Corel, get your pick tool, right click and paste it in there. Now I've always said that it's better to make it small, but let's see how it traces. Let's make our yellow box a little bit bigger. The yellow box is just a background. And you'll see, I'm actually gonna convert this to a bitmap and convert it to CMY color just so there's more colors. And in just a few seconds, it ought to start tracing. Well, it's already converted. Now we need to trace outline, trace clip art. <clears throat> and you can see it doesn't do a good job and we'll even bump up the details further and it's not there, but you can use those colors. So it doesn't have to be the same exact Donald Duck because uh, you can still grab those colors and we'll just kind of uh, draw a circle and Probably most likely you have to go to object and group and ungroup it so the colors will be different groups. And then we'll just, you. and I said there was a couple ways you could use the color eyedropper tool most of the time and get that blue and then fill in that blue. A lot of times when you're, if you'll see that you can't do that with the trace, uh, trace one, you have to group it and ungroup it and, and all that stuff. But this, so that worked in that case because I just drew the circle. But if you don't have that ability or it didn't work, you could always just use the smart field tool and do the same thing and then just go to the, it doesn't matter what this is set on because you're going to get the color. And let's get this, uh, now this one is mouth a little different color, but let's get that foot and fill in that foot so you got the exact same color of the drawing if that's what you're printing. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.